What is uncertainty? It is a property of wave-particle duality. And this is the foundation of modern physics. And we're interested in the most probable uncertainty. These symbols are conventional, but if you need to read them, type pause. Here's the wave packet, here's the wave, and here's the particle. And it's stable because this formula, the variable x, depends on the mean wave vector or momentum and the mean angular frequency or energy, and these are both conserved quantities in physics. We're here to discuss uncertainty and we'll start with special relativity and transform it with Planck's law and the de Broglie relationship to get this simple formula in simplified units. And as illustrations we can do some important things with this formula. We can differentiate it and find the product of the phase velocity and the group velocity is equal to c squared. Here's the phase velocity and here's the group velocity, and they're different when m is greater than zero. And if we differentiate again, we find Newton's second law of motion. But we're here to discuss uncertainty. Here's the group velocity, zero at low k tends to c at high k, as we're familiar in special relativity, while the phase velocity at long wavelength is very high and tends to see again at high k. What is the uncertainty in position? If we put t equals zero, the uncertainty position is something like the full width of maximum. We define it as the full width 1 over e of maximum. And then the uncertainty dx is 2 sigma. And what is the uncertainty in momentum? Well, we take this Fourier, this Gaussian, and transform it by Fourier analysis to this Gaussian. And uh, then the uncertainty in momentum, it's the full width half maximum of another Gaussian, it's equal to 4 over sigma. So the dx dkx is equal to 8. And if we transform k with the de Broglie relationship, we get the familiar kind of result dx dpx is equal to 8 times reduced h. This is 16 times greater than Heisenberg's limit. And the same happens in dt d omega. And we can sum up. For a free particle, the most probable uncertainty is 8h, and this is 16 times greater than Heisenberg's improbable limit. Meanwhile, in particular circumstances, the probable uncertainty can be accurately calculated from wave optics. We don't have to guess it.